In the world of entertainment, Molly Ephraim is a name that has garnered attention and admiration. She has made a mark in the industry with her talent, hard work, and dedication. Apart from her acting prowess, people are often curious about her financial success. In this video, we see net worth will delve into Molly Ephraim net worth and salary in 2023. What is Molly Ephraim's net worth and salary 2023? Molly Ephraim's net worth is expected to be at $3 million in 2023. This enormous number is mostly due to her acting career, for which she receives payments for appearances in films and television shows. She has also made money from appearances at events, which contributes to her annual income of thousands of dollars. Molly Ephraim Overview Early Life Ephraim was born on May 22, 1986, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and was raised Jewish. She grew up in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. Ephraim appeared in productions at the Bucks County Playhouse as well as at the Prince Music Theater and the Arden Theater Company in Philadelphia. Ephraim obtained a BA in Religious Studies from Princeton University in 2008 after graduating from Central Bucks East High School. She was a member of the Triangle Club at Princeton and performed and choreographed for the Princeton University Players and Theater in Time. Career Molly Ephraim is a talented American actress who has made her mark in various mediums, including films, television, and theater. She rose to fame for her portrayal of Mandy Baxter on the ABC, Fox sitcom Last Man Standing during its original run from 2011 to 2017. Ephraim had already committed to other projects when the show switched to Fox following its sixth season, and she declined to continue her role. Despite this, she still showcased her acting prowess in numerous TV series like Brockmire, 2017, Halt and Catch Fire, 2017, and Casual, 2018. In addition to her television work, Ephraim has appeared in several films, including College Road Trip, 2008, Paranormal Activity 2, 2010, Paranormal Activity, The Marked Ones, 2014, and The Front Runner, 2018 where she shared the screen with her Last Man Standing co-star Caitlin Deaver. Her performance as Gypsy Rose Blanchard's attorney in Hulu's The Act further solidified her reputation as a versatile actress. Ephraim's career also extends to the stage, where she made her Broadway debut as Little Red Riding Hood in the revival of Into the Woods in 2002, earning a Drama League Award nomination. She later played Bielk in a Broadway revival of Fiddler on the Roof, 2004, and took on roles in off-Broadway productions such as End Days at the Ensemble Studio Theater in 2009 and Bad Jews at the Geffen Playhouse in Los Angeles in 2015. Her regional theater credits include the 25th annual Putnam County Spelling Bee at the Barrington Stage Company and the Diary of Anne Frank at the Westport Country Playhouse. In recent years, Ephraim has continued to expand her acting portfolio appearing on HBO's Perry Mason as Della Street's lover Hazel Prystock and taking on the role of Maybelle Fox in the Amazon series A League of Their Own. Molly Ephraim has established herself to be a devoted and talented actor with various parts under her credit, continually delivering riveting performances across many platforms in the entertainment business. Personal Life In September 2021, Ephraim married. Evan, her husband, works for a software company. Ephraim gave birth to the couple's first child, daughter Zia, on December 1, 2021. Why is Molly Ephraim famous? Molly Ephraim's celebrity originates from her remarkable acting abilities. Her portrayal of Mandy Baxter in the long-running television series Last Man Standing propelled her to fame. Molly's ability to blend comedy with depth and passion distinguished her as a standout on the program, gaining her praise from both critics and audiences. FAQs about Molly Ephraim. Why did they replace Mandy on Last Man Standing? Last Man Standing was cancelled by its initial network, ABC, in 2017, but then moved to Fox for three more seasons. Unfortunately, when the revival announcement came, Ephraim had already begun looking for work in other plays and had decided not to repeat her part as Mandy. Who does Mandy end up with Last Man Standing? Kyle dated Kristen in season 1 and began seeing Mandy in season 2 before proposing to Mandy in season 5 and married her in season 6. What happened to Molly Ephraim? The 36-year-old actress is back on television, this time playing Maybelle Fox in the Amazon Prime video drama A League of Their Own, based on the 1992 film. Maybelle Blair, a real-life All-American Girls Professional Baseball League star, inspired Molly's persona. What is Molly Ephraim's age? 
She has 37 years of age. Who is the youngest girl in Last Man Standing? Caitlin Deaver was best known to everyone as Eve Baxter, the youngest daughter of Tim Allen's Mike Baxter in the hit TV show Last Man Standing. What happened to the oldest girl on Last Man Standing? She co-starred with Tim Allen in the ABC sitcom Last Man Standing from 2011 to 2012. Krosny's departure from the sitcom was revealed on June 11, 2012, for unexplained creative reasons. Amanda Fuller took over the position in season 2. Molly Ephraim is certainly on her way to becoming even more successful and reaching an impressive net worth of $3 million in 2023. With her acting career taking off, and her appearances at events, there's no telling what else she could achieve. Finally, thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe us to learn more interesting information about celebrities.